My sweet goats, welcome to another video. And this video has been one that you guys have been asking for for quite some time now. Yes, it is another internet numbnuts because you know what? The internet has absolutely no shortage of numbnuts. Numbnuts here, numbnuts there, numbnuts just about everywhere. So today we learned that Cyberpunk 2077 will allow you to actually make transgender and non-binary characters, you know, according to, according to the designer. And that's really quite wonderful because you know at the end of the day games should be about choice and allowing you to do whatever the f you want to do within the narrative that's set by the developer whoever's created you know because it ultimately comes down to the developer what they want to do what they envision for their product in the end that's what we should be going with that's what we should be respecting okay that's what we should be literally putting a respect on okay but you know what some people some people in the world don't seem to like this they don't seem to like choice they don't seem to like it when people get to represent themselves in video games and it just so happens that under this pc gamer tweet there's uh there's just a whole ton of, of absolute fucking losers losers absolute losers so let's start with this guy here his, his name is barry zabo man zabo man CD Projekt Red have added the ability to voluntary play as characters with mental health issues. <laughs> You're a fucking dumbass, dude. You really are. You're a dumb dumb. You're so stupid. Like I don't I don't understand why you choose to put out that negativity. This is something that should be celebrated. This is something that's like, hey, yo, by the way, uh, you get to do whatever the fuck you want in this game. Oh, I don't like that this game has transgender people in it because it fucks with my fragile identity. Get out of here, Zabo man. And then we got Epic Geezer over here, who I, I, I mean, that's just amazing that your, your handle is Epic Geezer. It, it's fitting, fitting, you know, because this is, I'm, I'm, I'm just at a loss of words here. The mentally ill rejoice, like, like, I don't get it, man. I don't get it, okay? I just don't get the hate for people who want to feel comfortable in their bodies. I just don't get that hate, you know? It makes no sense to me. So Epic Geezer, maybe reconsider your positions, all right? Maybe reconsider posting this next time, huh? And of course, yo, we got it. We got Slug Nacious. He says, yes, but can I identify as an Apache attack helicopter? <laughs> yo, check this guy out. It was God. He says, I don't even know what the f this guy's talking about, by the way. He says, people forget that we live in a free world, that people could do what they want, but on the other hand, that doesn't mean you can take away people's freedom of speech. I but remember just because some agree does not mean that all will agree. Remember, Illis God is on that skooma because Kometa kills the bourgeoisie epic pride style, says. <laughs> What a name. The f are you on about? This is about character customization in a video game. Like, that's like the video game equivalent of, sir, you're at a Wendy's. Then we got Praetor here, so I can be an Apache helicopter too? <laughs> God, man, that's f***ing sad. So we got God Rizla here with a smart take, and they say, can't wait for re-politics in my games. This inclusion in the game affects no one negatively. 100% correct. It absolutely affects no one negatively. It opens up choice oh we got f-15 javi i'm gonna be an attack helicopter oh, 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 oh. so now we got some other numbnuts and it's sue over here they're trying to damage control the transphobia i see what are you talking about what are you talking about okay why is this why 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 and then someone responds and say i'm hoping they were working on these the whole time and just wanted to have them as a surprise for later to have good pr everyone's this always an ulterior motive for people everyone's like they just can't accept something that's good they can't accept something that's nice you know there's always got to be a pr motive there's always got to be something wrong right uh the more likely situation is yes this is damage control and they're pushing folks to crunch to put this in cdpr fashion get out of here man get out of here maddie dwin easy clap no thank you well Enjoy not playing this game. Enjoy being a fake gamer. <laughs> this is good. This is a good meme. This is a really good meme. I like it. I like. <laughs> yeah, that's so funny. That's so funny. That's so funny. I love it. I love it. Good shit. My boy Solid Steak 44. He says groovy. Ah, that's my man. What's up, bro? I'm gonna give you a like. Whoa, Brooke Holden bringing it down a notch. Bare minimum achieved. Won't change the fact that this game will be absolutely riddled with creepy fetishist bullshit 
that will make my skin crawl and make me feel real bad having a trans character exist in the world, but whatever. Whoa. Whoa. And who's in your cornflakes? What's going on here? Yo. Don't play the game. Just don't play it, okay? Just avoid playing the game. You really, uh, it's definitely not for you. Oh, we got a bunch of tween unavailables. <laughs> I wonder what those losers had to say. We got Ride over here saying, imagine thinking this is an important and necessary feature. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, having, giving people more choice as, as, as video games develop and, and become better is, is definitely not really that important, right? <laughs> yeah, it's sick gamer, right? Sick gamer. Look at this guy. It's Danio25. Happy now, LGBT community? The f like, why are you unhappy? Why are you unhappy? It's Danio. Why are you, why are you upset, okay, that this is around? Why does them being happy mean that you are somewhat irate i don't i don't get it i am sean jones here it says makes sense in the setting i think it opens up a wider variety of gameplay and var variability and narrative to explore what it means to be human in a futuristic technically dystopian cyberpunk world man i am sean jones just buried buried here i don't know why but uh, i'm gonna go ahead and give that guy a like good for you sean jones good for you uh so someone here wrote something in russian uh, and i got microsoft to translate it for me it says well toleria the future Huli is not that. I don't know what that means. I don't know what that means at all. Um, a human number 2123837. Weird. Weird. Anyway, that's about it. Any more of that? And I would have probably died of radiation poisoning. I mean, that's just, that's just the reality of it. Uh, look, guys, if you enjoyed the video, I appreciate that. Feel free to go ahead and leave a like. Hit the sub button and ding that bell icon so you don't miss a single video, all right? Of course, if you want, you can also go ahead and share the video with a friend. And if you want to see me on a more regular basis, you can always go ahead and follow me on twitch.tv slash Mr. Bunty King, where I stream quite often. Look, until next time, I love you. Bye.